Hi, this is the second video for the 4AI porting to Panda board. Uh, as we saw in the previous video, audio and video playback are working. Let's see. And for example, something I saw today is that HDMI is working at 720p. But if for example, I may I make a video playback. It is switching to 1080p, so that is nice because we will have full HD for uh, video playback. Uh, now let's go to the features I recently add. That is the Bluetooth and Wi-Fi here. For Bluetooth, uh, I was able to connect to other devices uh, to send and get. Uh, files uh, turn it off uh, turn it on again um, for Wi-Fi uh, here we see all the networks available um, now if I go to the browser uh, we can navigate Okay, and uh, uh, for example, what I was doing today is uh, to try to install some applications. Uh, I installed Google Play Store, uh, but for example, I'm having some problems installing applications from here. For example, let's go to install Gmail application. Okay, if you see, there is a message that um, the device is not compatible with the with that version of, of the application. Um, that is not all true. Uh, the application is uh, probably is compatible, but uh, the device is like not registered uh, for work here in, in the Play Store or something. Um, what I did was to download the APK and try installing using ADB. Uh, for example, one application that I got working is Angry Birds. And you can look for more applications uh, for streaming or not to get your files, music, uh, videos from the cloud. Um, I think with this uh, you have a pretty much stable uh, platform for uh, I don't know to use it as an entertainment center or for any other kind of device. Um, also for uh, application development probably. Um, I hope you enjoy it and thank you.